Welcome everybody to version 3 of our Songs and Rhymes project. In version 3 we're going to learn how to add a parameter so that we can actually sing the song to a number of different people um, each in its own verse. So the first thing that we're going to have to do is create um, let's change the file name to Happy Birthday 3 so we can keep track of each version and then we've added um, both functions and parameters under assignments because these are topics we're going to talk about. So let's get down to the actual coding. Alright, so we're going to have to create another function called sing. So go ahead and type this in. And then we're going to transfer what's in the main up to our method called sing. Alright, now the reason that we're going to do this is we want to be able to sing to a different person each time. So in the first version it just sang to me. So we're going to have to change this to a generic name so that it would will actually we can call a different person's name into this parameter. So I'm just going to erase my name and I'm going to concatenate it with a general variable name. I'll just call it person and then I'll concatenate it again with the period at the end of the sentence. Now because I named my variable person here, I'm going to have to pass that variable in as a parameter into my method. And then finally in the end, in the, down here in the main, what we can do is each time we call our function sing, we can pass in a different person's name. So I'm just going to put in three different people and go ahead and take a few minutes to do that. If you need to stop the tape, that's fine. Now this is should be working, so we'll need to test it. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this into my ID. I'm just going to make a new window and I'm going to paste it in and then I'll go ahead and run it and it's going to ask me to save it. So I navigate to the folder I've created on the network and I'm going to type in the same file name but I'll add 3 to the version of it. I'm going to hit OK Alright, so you saw it printing to the screen and it was playing in my headset. So you can see we have a couple of minor formatting problems here. We'd probably like a space in between the names and we might want a space in between each of the verses. So we'll go back to our message here and in order to get that space in between um, we're gonna put the cursor between the two and the quotes and add that space right there. And then in order to um, get a space in between each of um, our lines, we can actually um, put in a print statement at the bottom and put blank quotes in and then it should work. So let's go ahead and run it once more to test it. So I'm going to hit run and save. And there you can see it fixed our formatting problems. Alright, so that's it for this time. And in version 4, we are going to learn how to um, ask for user input so that you can actually type in different people's names to sing to. So we'll see you next time.